So another bloke who's called this out, of course, because one of the one of the arguments here is we all should be driving electric cars, right? Now electric cars are great, knock yourself out, but we shouldn't all be forced into them. And Rowan Atkinson, of course, the brilliant comedian, has written a column in the Guardian, explaining that he's realised that he's been duped on this. Increasingly, I feel a little duped when you start to drill into the facts. Electric motoring doesn't seem to be quite the environmental panacea it's claimed to be. The problem lies with the lithium-ion batteries fitted currently to nearly all electric vehicles. They're absurdly heavy, many rare earth metals and huge amounts of energy are required to make them, and they only last about 10 years. Hey, presto, <laughs> they're not so good for the bloody environment. You know, Chris, the more people know about cars, the less, in general, they're enthusiastic about electric vehicles. Now, Rowan Atkinson goes way back in terms of his car enthusiasm. He's owned things like McLaren F1s. He's owned a lot of very spectacular vehicles. He knows how to drive them quickly. I mean, he's also got a licence to drive, I think, um, semi-trailers on British freeways. So his, uh, his enthusiasm for vehicles is, uh, is, is, is noted. Now, this guy has picked all the main things that are wrong with electric cars, especially the fact that they're heavy. It means that they're not fun to drive, Chris. It means that they're ponderous and awful and slow. They <laughs> are not enjoyable. It's like they're trying to steal all the fun from even just going to the shops, my friend. To tonight's program brought to you by Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly, yeah.